Okay, I took this one off the top, so we should be in good shape. Here, that's the crew's fingerprints and handprints on there. Like, that's just. Apollo 16 was an Apollo mission that flew to the moon in 1972. Uh, this year is going to be the 50th anniversary of that flight. And so since this is where that capsule lives, obviously we want it looking its best. We clean because it is always better when you're looking at something that's nice and clean, but also cleaning is an important part of conserving the object for the future. Whether that's a spacecraft or it's a space suit or you know, any kind of museum object will occasionally need to be cleaned uh, in an appropriate way so that you are preserving it for future generations. Hold your vacuum near where you're working and then you take your brush and you flick. Right? So you're kind of lifting it up like this. You know, keeping the dust off is uh, more than just for the look. Um, dust is made up of things like silica dust, but it's also made up of things like skin cells and um, could be uh, pollen or all sorts of things. And so those different materials, if they were to build up and just stay there, could cause a lot of problems down the road. The case is not completely hermetically sealed, which is actually an important thing. You don't want to completely seal it off and have no air circulation. Um, and so we do occasionally get insects and fluff and those sorts of things in there. Um, sometimes some foreign debris, you know, makes it in there by people trying to do things. There's a reason I got into this business, um, and it is because I love this stuff. I love this topic, I love the hardware, I love the stories. Um, so for me, anytime I can work around the objects um, is an absolute pleasure, because it, it's, from the time I was knee high, I was obsessed with astro astronauts and the space shuttle and all that stuff. So I mean, it really, it, it, is, it is what I do as a job, but it is also my passion. This is a piece of history that human beings should be able to enjoy millennia from now, not just in the next few decades or centuries, but uh, it should be kept and preserved because it represents uh, one of the greatest triumphs of the space program of the planet Earth.